All right, so today we have got one mission. We have got three geography quizzes starting at beginner, intermediate, and then apparently impossible. So let's jump in, see how we go. See if we can beat them. Starting right here. Quiz number one, you should be kind of embarrassed if you can't pass this basic geography test. I'll tell you something, I'm not here to be embarrassed. I'm not here to be embarrassed. Let's see how we go. Um, okay, which mountain range stretches across seven countries in Europe? Andes, Rockies, the Himalayas, and the Alps. By the way, play along guys, see how you go as well. Let me know in the comments below how you would have ranked. The mountain range that goes through Europe is the Alps. Yes. Not gonna lie, that's, this is harder than I thought. Which river is the longest in the world? Nile, Amazon, Mississippi, or Yangtze maybe, Yangtze River. Uh, okay, it's definitely one of these two, not sure. I'm pretty sure it's the Amazon. Oh, it's the Nile. Oh no. What was this called again? Can't pass. We'll pass. We'll pass. Don't worry. We'll pass. Okay, we got that one wrong. I really don't want to get any more wrong, but we, we're starting this at a higher level than I was expecting. That's for sure. The Nile is the longest. Wow. Okay. Interesting. All right. On to three. What is the largest island country in the world? So if I'm just looking at these, this is so tricky because I wonder if it is just talking about land land mass or like physically the largest including like the water that is in between indonesia has a lot of land indonesia is a bit of a sleeper there's at least there's like three main islands in indonesia and one of them's quite big philippines i feel like is kind of smallish japan's kind of smallish as well but japan also has tons of islands as a part of itself i think it has to be indonesia oh man i i thought these are going to be heaps easier Oh, okay, thank goodness for that. Which country is famous for the Great Barrier Reef? Belize, Australia, Philippines, and the Maldives? Maldives? It's Australia. Woohoo, we got, we got a home one. We got one on our home soil. Love that. Great Barrier Reef up in Queensland. Amazing. All right. Which river? Okay, scared of river questions. Which river runs through the Grand Canyon? Okay, I will tell you something. I've never heard of this before. Mississippi River came up before. Rio Grande sounds... Spanish or Portuguese, Columbia River, Colorado River. Is is the Grand Canyon in Colorado or is it in Utah? All right, I feel like 50-50 is gonna put us down to one of these two. Let's do Colorado. Oh, okay. Which country is famous for its tulips and windmills? Okay, Switzerland, Denmark, Netherlands, or Belgium. I believe this is gonna be Netherlands. It could be Denmark, but I think, yeah. Which continent is the driest inhabited continent okay africa or australia the driest inhabited continent i mean the desert in australia is huge and very dry yeah i think it's going to be africa i'm really nervous that it's going to be like south america somehow uh, but i think it's going to be africa it's australia oh, yeah, i've literally never heard that <laughs> which country is known as the land of the rising sun we've got china vietnam japan or south korea uh, it is Japan. I do know this. Happy. I'm happy for a freebie. That's for sure. All right. What is the largest desert in the world? Okay. Arabian Desert, Kalahari Desert, Gobi Desert, or Sahara Desert? I mean, is it the Sahara? Kalahari, Sahara. I think it's the Sahara. It's the largest on the block. Yeah. Cool. Great. Which ocean is the largest by size? Pacific, Arctic, Indian, or Atlantic? I think it's the Pacific Ocean. Yeah. Great. What is the largest island in the Mediterranean Sea? Okay. Sicily, Crete, Corsica, Sardinia. Uh, now, I always get these ones confused. I don't think it's Crete. I think Corsica is the hot, is the most northern one of the three. So I think it's one of these two. I'm going to go Sicily. Yes, that's good. Ooh. I feel like Sardinia is not that much smaller, to be honest. Which country is both in Europe and Asia? Uh, Russia, Turkey, Kazakhstan, or as a Azerbaijan, I think that's called. It's Russia, I believe. Makes sense because it's so big. Wait, what? I literally didn't know that. I was I was sure that was Russia. Wow. Okay. Okay. What is the largest country by land area in South America? Uh, Brazil, Colombia, Argentina, Peru. I think it's got to be Brazil. Uh, Brazil is a massive country. What is the largest city in the United States by population? Okay, this is going to be hard. Houston, Chicago, Los Angeles, or New York City? Houston is a, is a large city, but I feel like maybe 
by population it's not i think new york is so dense but yet it's so small could definitely be la i'm gonna go new york nice that's great happy with that which country is famous for its fjords iceland norway sweden or finland i believe it's norway uh yep love that what is the capital city of australia sydney canberra Melbourne or Brisbane? Uh, this is actually a really tricky question if you don't live here. I feel like a lot of people would think it's Sydney. It's actually Canberra. Um, Canberra was built to be the capital and they put it between Sydney and Melbourne. I think this is like a bit of a bit of a rumor. I don't know, but I think they were just fighting over it and they were like, nah, stuff is both for putting it right in the middle. Which country is known as the land of fire and ice? Okay, United States, Finland, Norway, and Iceland. Iceland kind of makes sense, right? Because I guess it's super cold, but it's volcanic. So that makes sense to me. Which river is often called the father of waters? The Nile, Amazon, Mississippi, Yangtze. I'm gonna say Amazon for this one. Mississippi, father of waters, never heard of it. There you go. Which African country is known as the Pearl of Africa? Rwanda, Uganda, Kenya, Tanzania. Hmm, I wonder what they mean by the Pearl of Africa. I wouldn't think that like Kenya and Uganda just based on like, I don't know, like their location and I don't know, I don't feel like the Pearl kind of thing. Tanzania, similar, kind of similar vibe. Um, I'm gonna say Rwanda, maybe because it's like in the middle. So it's kind of like the Pearl in the shell. Uganda, I'll put on the screen, why? Because I have no idea. What is the capital city of Spain? Uh, Madrid, Barcelona, Seville, and Valencia. I believe it's Madrid. Yes. Oh, there we go. 15 out of 20. Stoked. There we go. I, I don't have to feel ashamed. I've passed. Now we move on to the next. All right, on to number two. This is our medium quiz. If you can guess over seven of these countries just from their outlines, I'll be seriously impressed. I don't know. I don't know if this is the kind of thing I can do or not, but this is our medium quiz. Let's see how we go. What country is this? Multiple choice. Okay. Brazil, Argentina, Colombia, Paraguay. Uh, I know that this is Brazil. Maybe we are good at this. Let's find out. How about this one? Oh, yes, I do know this one. Indonesia, Malaysia, Vietnam, or Japan. Let me know how you guys went. This is Japan. Okay, what is this one? A couple of seconds to look at it. Denmark, Sweden, Norway, or the United Kingdom. This one's the United Kingdom. What is this one? A couple of seconds to look at it. This one is South Africa. How about this one? Ooh, okay. I don't know this one on first inspection. I'm not sure with this kind of... Um, with this kind of curl here. Uh, now it's obvious, I think. Nicaragua, Panama, Costa Rica, and Guatemala. Oh, actually, I'm not sure. I think it's Panama, yes. Okay, what is this country? Oh, not sure about this one either. It's tricky with, I'll say, with outlines it's tricky because you don't get any kind of sense of scale. So I'm definitely gonna be using the multiple choice for this one. Uh, Ethiopia, Eritrea, I'd never even heard of that. Somalia, Djibouti. I haven't heard of these two at all. I'm going to have to guess one of these two. I'm going to say it's this one, but I genuinely have no clue. It is Ethiopia. Interesting. Okay. First one wrong. First one wrong. How about this? Holy dooly. That's a lot. There's a lot of islands in there. Micronesia, Greece, Indonesia, or Malaysia. Wow. Okay. On first inspection, I didn't recognize this at all. But now that I've seen it, I'm almost positive that this is Greece. Yeah, wow. How are you guys going? Let me know in the comments. Okay, how about this one? Okay, we've got lots of little islands here. I feel like this is quite a large place probably. Okay, China, Canada, Australia, or Germany. I know the answer is Canada, but what's happening here? Isn't this Canada here as well? Anyway, we got it, so I'm stoked. Okay, what is this country? Ooh, again, gonna need multiple choice for this one. Nice long one here. Uh, Jamaica, Dominica, Bahamas, or Barbados. Uh, I believe this is the Dominican Republic right here. Oh, it's Jamaica. Similar shape. They must be a similar shape. I'll put up uh, Dominican Republic here so you can have a look. That's that's tricky. That got me good. That got me good. How about this one? Oh, I mean, this feels like this is a lazy drawing, this one. Sri Lanka, Bhutan, Nepal, or Bangladesh. Okay, thankfully, because of the shape of it, uh, it is Sri Lanka. Do know that it's that kind of teardrop shape next to India there. Okay, next up here, we've got this one here. I am pretty familiar with this one. It is our neighbor, New Zealand. Finally, what is this country? Ooh, look at these interesting borders. I've got an idea about this before we get to the multiple choice, but let's have a look. Monaco, Vatican City, Nauru, or Tuvalu. I did think it was Vatican City just because of these strange shapes. I think they're literally walls, yes. That's good. We got 10 out of 12, guys. 10 out of 12. We guessed over seven. Therefore, that's a win. On to the third. How are you guys going so far? Have you passed both yet? 
let me know. All right, on to the third. Most people can't pass this geography quiz, but I'd love to see you try. All right, we're gonna try. We're gonna do our best. I don't know. I don't know what to expect in this one at all. I know this is a difficult one. So in which city can one find the Hagia Sophia Grand Mosque? Okay, I'll tell you. On initial reading, I am not familiar with this mosque whatsoever. Rome, Istanbul, Tehran, Ankara. I'm gonna go Istanbul just because it works culturally. Great. Uh, but genuinely never heard of that. I didn't have a clue at all. Okay, which real Greek island was mythological hero Odysseus from? Odysseus of Ithaca. I think Ithaca sounds right. Odysseus of Ithaca. Nice. That is, I pulled that out of like year eight school, like 15 years ago. Okay, which country is home to the deepest lake in the world? Interesting. Canada, Kyrgyzstan. Argentina or Russia? The deepest lake. Again, I don't know. I've um, I've really kind of just logic my way through these so far. I'm thinking it's one of these two. I'm gonna go Kyrgyzstan. Even though it feels so wrong. Russia, never even considered it. All right, which country's flag is this? I am terrible at flags, I'll tell you that. So I'm hoping that I just kind of recognize the other ones. Okay, Myanmar, Guinea, Benin, or Uganda? I don't know. You'll be surprised to hear, I don't know at all. I don't think it's Uganda. I'm gonna say Guinea. Looks like the countries look kind of African. Um, I hope it's in Africa, so what I just said was also correct, but I don't know, we might be two and two right now. We might be actually like equal here. When was the first Atlas published? Okay, I'm thinking it's just gonna be the really old one. Yeah, I'm going for the oldest one. It was the newest one. <laughs> oh man, I think we're in the negative right now. I think we need to get a few here. What is the capital city of the Democratic Republic of the Congo, Brazzaville, Luanda, Kinshasa, Abuja, Abuja. I mean, you've got to go Brazzaville, right? <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> this could be bad. What does it mean if a species is endemic? Again, I'll tell you, I've never heard this word before, so I'm hoping to use some logic here to work it out. It is found in one particular geographic area. Not too bad. It's vulnerable to extinction. Its native region has shifted over time. It has no, has no natural predators. I'm gonna say it's only found in one area. Let's go. Purely a vibe check, honestly. Purely a vibe check. Which country is the world's largest producer of sugar? Thailand, Brazil, India, or USA? Hmm. I do feel like Thailand is big in the sugar cane. Um, USA probably is as well, honestly. Um, but feels like one of those things where I, don't, I just don't know about Brazil and India. Uh, so these are the two that I have some knowledge of at least. I think Thailand is big on sugarcane. So I'm gonna go for Thailand. India, ooh, okay. What is the national animal of Wales? Dragon, unicorn, basilisk, or lion? See, they're just having a laugh at me now. So the dragon is on their flag. They've got a green dragon on their flag. Um, I get that they've done three things here that aren't real animals. Uh, I'm so nervous that the answer is lion because it's the only real one, but I think I have to go with the dragon being on their flag. I'm so, if it's unicorn, I mean, like, it wouldn't even surprise me at all. It literally wouldn't even surprise me at all. Okay, Whew, we got the dragon. Let's go. Okay, lastly, oh man, I think if I get this right, I've maybe broke even. I don't know. Lastly, the ancient city of Babylon was located in which modern country? Babylon, Syria. Iran, Iraq, or Jordan? Um, I think it's in Jordan, right? Babylon, I think it's in Jordan. These guys are all pretty close to each other, but I would have thought, honestly, if I didn't see the multiple choice, I would have thought Israel. So I'm gonna go Jordan, because they're right next to each other. Oh, it's Iraq, I got four out of 10. Yeah, I needed to get that one just to break even. Oh man, all right, that one's a fail. Number three, that's a fail. Oh, that is tough. That is tough. All right, guys. Well, I just realized I didn't do an outro for this video. So, wow. That last one, I just went back over it again. That was super hard. Let me know in the comments below how you went. Did you pass the third one in particular? That was crazy. There's some hard questions there. Guys, if you had a good time, why don't you subscribe? Click the button right there. Otherwise, there's a video right there that YouTube thinks you like. So, you can click on that and watch another one from me if you want to. All right. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye. Hope you enjoyed.